A blessed Sunday to all of you, dear friends. You are tuned in to OLMC Sunday Best. This is a sharing of the Bible study group from the parish of Our Lady of Mount Carmel, Wan Chai, Hong Kong. Join us now in reflecting on this Sunday's liturgy for our life's nourishment. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Let us pray together the collect, the entrance pray, the opening prayer. Almighty and merciful God, by this gift you are faithful offering you right and praiseworthy service. Grant, we pray, that we may hasten with our stumbling to receive the things you have promised. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. And may I ask, uh, MJ, can you just tell us the, uh, the outline? Re yes, the outline of the readings for this Sunday. So yeah, uh, the first reading is, was taken from the book of Deuteronomy, uh, chapter, chapter 6, uh, verse 2 to 6. Yes. Responsorial Psalm is from chapter 18, verse 2 to 3, 3 to 4, 47, and 51. Mm -hmm. And the second reading was taken from the letter of the Hebrews, uh, chapter 7, 20, verse 23 to 28. And the Gospel was taken from Mark, chapter 12, verses uh, 28b, uh, that's 34. 34. Okay, so thank you. Uh, readings on the 31st Sunday in Ordinary Time. Okay. Now, uh, Ishmael, can you read for us the, the first reading? The first reading, please. Okay, sure. Okay. A reading from the book of Deuteronomy. Moses spoke to the people, saying, Fear the Lord your God, and keep throughout the days of your lives all his statutes and commandments which I which I enjoin on you, and thus have long life. Hear then Israel, and be careful to observe them, that you may grow and prosper the more, in keeping with the promise of the Lord, the God of your fathers, to give you a land flowing with milk and honey. Hear, O Israel, the Lord is our God, the God alone, the Lord alone. Therefore you shall love the Lord your God with all your heart, and with all your soul, and with all your strength. Take to heart these words which I enjoin on you today. The word of the Lord. Thanks, Thanks be to God. God. Anybody knows which, where, what is this book of Deuteronomy? Deuteronomy? Where do you find this? In the Exodus. first testament. In, in, the, the, new, in the Old Testament? Yeah, yeah. Old yeah. Testament. Yes. The which journey of Moses. The, the first five books, the right. Pentateuch. So you have what? Genesis, Exodus, Leviticus, Numbers, Numbers, Numbers and Deuteronomy. That's the last of the five books there, no? Mm -hmm. Deutero means second, nomos is law, so second law, because this is what they found, no? This book, Deuteronomy, was found during the, the time of the rebuilding of the temple, no? Mm -hmm. And this contains really the law so the ten commandments the, of course the first version is in exodus mm -hmm. but then the you say the development and the the restructuring or rewarding is also here in deuteronomy so this is a very important book and what we have here is, is still the words of moses no mm -hmm. the, the words of moses so moses spoke to the people saying fear the lord your god and keep throughout the days of your lives all his statutes and commandments. Because our topic is really about the commandments. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay? Uh, in the gospel, Jesus will be asked, what is the greatest of all the commandments? Mm -hmm. Very interesting though here is, I don't know, did you notice what word is repeated? There is one word repeated mm -hmm. in this reading. It's a very important word, but very difficult to do. It's here. Here, then Israel. The first paragraph, 
And then in the second paragraph again, Hear, O Israel. Mm -hmm. Okay? Do you agree that hearing is very difficult? Yes. <laughs> Listening. <laughs> it's, it's easier to talk. Yes. Right. Sometimes it's fuzzier and it will go up here. <laughs> <laughs> difficult to hear. But you see, <laughs> commandment involves really, uh, I mean, the, the doing of the commandment, the fulfillment of the commandment first requires hearing. Mm. Hear then, O Israel, no? And the way you hear also. Uh, second thing here is that part, Hear, O Israel, the Lord is our God, the Lord alone. This is the famous Shema. Shema. You know the Shema? Hear, O Israel, is the daily prayer of the Jews. Oh, is that right? The pious Jews would mm -hmm. pray, Shema Israel, Adonai oh. Elohenu, Adonai Ehad. Wow. No? Mm -hmm. So, Hear, O Israel, the Lord your God is one. Mm -hmm. Is one, so that's why you call it monotheistic, no religion. Mm -hmm. One God, mm -hmm. and the the next line is what they pray. So this is really a prayer. This is not just an injunction to do. It's not just a commandment. Mm -hmm. uh, so they pray this: Shema uh, Israel, Adonai Eloheinu, Adonai Ehad. Then you shall love the Lord your God with all of your heart with all of your soul and with all of your strength mm -hmm. if you follow through this reading mm -hmm. the command this commandment will say you have to put it on your forehead <laughs> tie this on your forehead oh. no the pious, and then on your arms mm -hmm. no mm -hmm. and put that in in all the pockets okay. and the in the small uh, what do you call this the, the parts of the clothing mm -hmm. carry it with you Externally, but also most importantly, internally. Mm -hmm. you know? So, with all of your, the first thing is heart, soul, because that is the seat, no? The seat of mm -hmm. the person. Mm -hmm. Okay? With all of your heart, soul, with all of your soul, and with all of your strength. Mm -hmm. So, actually, it's your whole person. Mm -hmm. That is, uh, they say, the anthropology of the Jew is the heart. The soul and the strength. The strength would be all the energies that you have. No, mm -hmm. loving the Lord your God with all of your being. Mm -hmm. Okay, and that is what we what they pray for every day. That mm -hmm. they will be able to do that. Mm -hmm. Okay, so if you connect this to the gospel reading, as we always say, no. The first reading is like an announcement of the theme yeah. of the Gospel reading. Mm -hmm. Now, we will hear in the Gospel reading how this will be repeated and also developed. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Mark. One of the scribes came to Jesus and asked him, Which is the first of all the commandments? Jesus replied, The first is this, Hear, O Israel, the Lord our God is Lord alone. You shall love the Lord your God with all your heart, with all your soul, with all your mind, and with all your strength. This is the second. The second is this. The second is this. You shall love your neighbor as yourself. There is no other commandment greater than this. The scribe said to Jesus, Well said, teacher. You are right in saying, He is one and there is no other than He. And to love Him with all your heart, with all your understanding, with all your strength, and to love your neighbor as yourself, is worth more than all burnt offerings and sacrifices. And when Jesus saw that the scribe answered with understanding, Jesus, Jesus said to him, you are not far from the kingdom of God, and no one dared to ask Jesus any more questions. The Gospel of the Lord. Thanks. Praise, Praise the Lord, Lord Jesus Christ. Christ. You notice the connection, very, very, very intense and strong connection. No? Mm, yeah. Well, let's let's uh, focus first on this scribe. Who is who is a scribe? Well, it's it's from the word itself no 
scribe is one who writes. writes. Mm -hmm. And what do they write? write? Like what do they write? The minutes. The, the law. <laughs> the law. This, is, this, is like, this is like an expert on the law. <laughs> that they are so good that they can write, you know. Mm -hmm. It's like a, our monks. Mm -hmm. okay. The monks especially of the, the past, no? mm -hmm. who really transcribe. Mm -hmm. The word scribe, yeah. transcribe. No? So they are really the experts of the law. And he would know actually the answer. There is one version of this also in Luke. No, Luke mm -hmm. ten. You remember he also asked then, uh, what is the greatest commandment? So mm -hmm. the first is this, and then you shall love your neighbor as mm -hmm. yourself. And then he continued to test Jesus, but who is my neighbor? Yeah. You remember <laughs> that? <laughs> that is the version in Luke. Yeah. This version in, in Mark is more straightforward because actually. You notice the last the last line of the, the gospel and no one dared to ask Jesus any more questions. Why? Because if you start with chapter twelve, there are really a series of questions. Okay? The the Herodians were sent to test Jesus. Does your master is it lawful to pay uh, taxes, taxes oh, okay. to Caesar or not? Yeah. One test, no, mm -hmm. and then another test about marriage, about about oh. the authority and what authority are you speaking? Oh. So, all the, if you, when you have time tonight, mm -hmm. go back to chapter twelve of Mark, mm -hmm. okay, and then see all those questions. It's like Jesus having a final exam, <laughs> mm -hmm. <Okay. laughs> and so this seems to be. At least in that chapter, the last. Mm -hmm. you know? Now it's the turn of this scribe. And so the question is, of all the many commandments, you know, because uh, how many are the, the ten commandments mm -hmm. that we have are? Ten. <laughs> okay. Yeah. But then, with all the different uh, ways to safeguard the ten, mm -hmm. how many precepts do we have or the, do the Jews have in the end? Two. How many? Two. <laughs> they have 613. Mm -hmm. 613. <laughs> okay, the precepts which came out of that because you have to protect every move. Like you shall keep the Sabbath day holy. So how do you take the Sabbath day holy? Do not walk too long or too far. <laughs> you should not do this kind of work and that kind of work. So you, you know, you know what I mean? It's like the fence, no? Mm -hmm. The fence that you put around the law. Mm -hmm. So from ten we have six hundred percent times. <laughs> it's like that, no? So this scribe was asking Jesus, so which is the first of all your commandments? If you have all of this, mm -hmm. all this series of commandments which is the first? Yeah, one to four. <laughs> so, <laughs> so you, you see the response of Jesus, prayer of the pious Jew. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Hear, O Israel, mm -hmm. the Lord our God is Lord alone. It's like commandment number one, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You shall, no, you shall, there is only one God. You shall adore yeah. only one God. Oh, yes. Okay, keep his name holy. Mm -hmm. And then, the Sabbath day holy. So, mm -hmm. you shall love the Lord your God, no, mm -hmm. with all of your mm -hmm. heart, mm -hmm. with soul, all of your soul. soul. Your and then he added what? Mind. mind. With all of your mind mm -hmm. and with all of your, your strength. Mm -hmm. Somehow, maybe the mind here is because, you know, they are already intermingling with another culture. There's also the Greek culture now, no, which is mm -hmm. strong on the mind. Mm -hmm. Okay, so there is the addition here also of the mind. Mm -hmm. Okay, and what is the second? He says, love your neighbor. You shall love your neighbor as yourself. Because practically from number four of the commandment up to ten, mm -hmm. what is the subject of that? What about other people. Okay, your neighbor. My parents. Honor your I father and mother. Thou shall not kill. Thou shall not mm -hmm. So Jesus is really a super teacher. Mm -hmm. I mean, he managed to synthesize, you know, into commandments. Mm -hmm. All those ten. Okay. And this uh, second 
commandment here, you shall love your neighbors as yourself, is also a, a quote from Leviticus 19, 18. Chapter 19, verse 18. No. Your neighbor, uh, wh who would be your neighbor? Before it's really the one just close to you. It's, it's your, if you're a Filipino, you're fellow Filipino. If you're Malaysian, you're fellow Malaysian, etc. No? It's, mm -hmm. only, it's only like that. But little by little, because of the intermingling of cultures, mm -hmm. it grew wider. The whole mm -hmm. community. So, mm -hmm. Your neighbor is anybody who really needs your help mm -hmm. okay and in fact in in leviticus mm -hmm. you have also the precept for instance if you have a field you should not harvest everything there but always leave something for the strangers for the neighbors mm -hmm. okay uh, neighbors the the concept of neighbor has grown uh in in the fratelli mm -hmm. tutti of Pope mm -hmm. Francis, that's what mm -hmm. he was insisting. It, the neighbor is anybody who needs your help. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, it's not just your fellow. Uh, it's the same blood or the mm -hmm. same culture or the same Friends. class. Mm -hmm. No, mm -hmm. it's much wider. Mm -hmm. Okay, so, but uh, I guess it's also clear. You shall love your neighbor as mm -hmm. yourself means. You love yourself first. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I mean to say, mm -hmm. what is your measure of loving others? Mm -hmm. If you don't know how to love yourself. If you do not know how to love yourself, mm -hmm. no? If you always put yourself uh, low, below, and uh, you get yourself abused, mm -hmm. so it's, it will be probable that you will be doing the same thing mm -hmm. on, the, on the others. Yes. Right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's your way of loving yourself that you mm -hmm. also use in loving others. Mm -hmm. And that's why I say, I call this session the three loves. Mm -hmm. Okay, love of God, love, love of others, and as yourself. And you okay? Yes. The love of self is also important mm -hmm. in the right way. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, maybe in the application we will see, okay. we will see later, no? How, how to put that into practice. Mm -hmm. And here there, there is a very peaceful uh, interaction between Jesus and this scribe. It seems they are in the same vibration, can you say that? <laughs> because in the end, the scribe no, affirmed what mm -hmm. Jesus said. He said, mm -hmm. what? You are right. You are right in right. saying he is one and there is, and no, there is no other than he. There is only one God, you know. Mm -hmm. And to love Him with all your heart, with all your really understanding, all, all your strength, strength and, and to love, love your neighbor, neighbor as yourself is worth than more than offerings and sacrifices. sacrifices. Okay? It's worth m m than, than all the things that you can offer. Maybe mm -hmm. sometimes we say uh, our worship, our liturgy is so great, it's so beautiful. No, mm -hmm. what is What the Lord is asking from us is this, no? Mm -hmm. uh, total surrender of ourselves to Him, but also our mm -hmm. way and the quality of our loving others mm -hmm. as ourselves. Uh, as I'm saying, if you compare this with the Gospel of Luke, there's still the, the scribe is not in the same vibration. <laughs> okay? <laughs> That's why the scribe would still ask, but who is my neighbor? Mm -hmm. No, mm -hmm. here there is no question. Mm -hmm. There is no question. Mm -hmm. In fact, Jesus also affirmed this scribe and said, "You are not far from the kingdom of God." Mm -hmm. So now you have you have what understood. Mm -hmm. No, you have understood this uh, commandment, this synthesis of the commandment. That they, they, there is actually mm -hmm. only one commandment with two faces. Mm -hmm. Okay, the love of God and the love of neighbor as yourself. Now, who practiced that perfect love? We will see now in the second reading. Because it is not easy, you know, <coughs> to practice. Mm -hmm. Shall we ask my Yes. yes. Yeah. You, okay, can you read it louder, please? Yes. A reading from the letter of the Hebrews. To the Hebrews, yes. <coughs> Brothers and sisters, the Levitical priests were many because they were prevented by death from remaining in office. But Jesus, 
because he remains forever has a priesthood that does not pass away. Therefore, Jesus is always able to save those who approach God through him, since he lives forever to make intercession for them. It was fitting that we should have such a high priest, holy, innocent, undefiled, separated from sinners, higher than the heavens. He has no need, as did the high priest, to offer sacrifice day after day, first for his own sins and then for those of the people. Jesus did that once for all when he offered himself. For the law appoints men subject to weakness, to be high priests. But the word of the oath, which was taken after the law, appoint, appoints a son who has been made perfect forever. The word of the Lord. Thanks, Thanks be to God. God. In the first place, mm -hmm. uh, do you believe that Jesus was a priest? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Actually, yeah, if you bias. if you use the what the genealogical way of defining a priest in the mm -hmm. Old Testament, mm -hmm. he would not fit the criteria because the priesthood in the Old Testament is by lineage. Mm -hmm. It should come mm -hmm. from Levi. the tribe of Levi, Levi or Levi, no, yeah. mm -hmm. like Aaron. No, mm -hmm. Moses, like uh, who else in the New Joshua. Testament? Joshua. Zechariah, the father of John, John the Baptist. Uh -huh. you know? this, this will be the priest. Mm -hmm. So, Jesus does not belong to that tribe. What is the tribe of Jesus? Okay. Judah. 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 Mm -hmm. Okay, so Judah. So he will not be a priest. But here in the let it's only here in the letter to the Hebrews mm -hmm. that you have this reinterpretation of the priesthood. Mm -hmm. And it's only here that you will see Jesus as the priest. Mm -hmm. Only in this letter, in no other part. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay? And it describes also the difference. Uh, see? Brothers and sisters, the Levitical priests, see, mm -hmm. from Levi, mm -hmm. the Levitical priests were many because they were prevented by death from, from remaining me. in office. Now, Jesus, who already, uh, what, he died and Listen. rose, mm -hmm. and now how is, he, how is his priesthood uh, defined here? His priesthood See, is not yeah, it's forever. forever. It remains forever. He remains forever because he has risen and he now intercedes for us on the throne of the Father. Mm -hmm. Jesus is always able to save those who approach God through him since he lives forever to make intercession for them. So it's not like the priesthood that you have to change year in, year out. Yeah? And his sacrifice is also the perfect sacrifice. Why? Because he offered himself. Mm. It's also here. And he was unstained. Okay. His priesthood is holy, innocent, undefiled, undefiled. separated from sinners, Higher than the heavens. His, his priesthood is of another quality. <clears throat> Do not ask me now why the priesthood that we have now has seemed to be. <laughs> no, because this uh, this is the this is the influence of history. You know, when uh, if you read a little bit of church history and Constantine accepted Christianity yeah. as the religion, yeah. so we we started getting again the the trimmings of mm -hmm. the imperial church. I yeah. mean, the church became like an imperial institution. Mm -hmm. But if you go really, this way it's very important to know the Bible, okay? Mm -hmm. This uh, priesthood that we're talking in the New Testament, if you follow Christ, is this 
kind of priesthood. It's an offering of self. Mm -hmm. You are the priest, but you are also the victim, and you are the sacrifice, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. which is which has its perfection because it is a participation in the priesthood of Christ. Mm -hmm. It is not you. In fact, we call the priest what an other Christus, no, an other Christ. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, mm -hmm. and uh, somehow I don't know. Your our expectation is this priest is consecrated really for this perfect love of God mm -hmm. and love of neighbor, mm -hmm. which brings us to the theme of our gospel, mm -hmm. okay? Mm -hmm. We have the figure of this perfect lover of God and of neighbor. And of course, the way he loves the neighbor is also the way he loves himself. No? Mm -hmm. that, is, that is important. You cannot have I don't know, a priest who has a very low self-esteem <laughs> will have difficulty really treating others. Mm. Mm. Okay? <laughs> but uh, what is important here is that we understand the priesthood of Jesus, the mm. priesthood of Christ, mm. no? Different from the Old Testament priesthood. Mm. Yeah, I hope that's clear. Mm. Mm. Okay, and then maybe for our uh, further Bible study, you read... Hebrews 7. Hebrews 7, no? Mm -hmm. It's really just about the priesthood of Christ. Because mm -hmm. uh, as I said, it's only here, mm -hmm. it's only here that you will see Jesus uh, identified and uh, given to us with that image of a priest no, in no other book of the mm -hmm. New Testament. Mm -hmm. Okay? Now, let, let us go seven. to the application part. Maybe this... Uh, Three loves, <clears throat> the three loves, mm -hmm. the love of God, you no, know, with our, our total being, but also the love of our neighbor as ourselves. <laughs> or actually, it's both difficult, you know. Both difficult. <clears throat> yeah. Anybody would like to to comment on what we're saying? That first, the love of neighbor mm -hmm. as yourself, you no, know? the love of neighbor. How mm -hmm. to love one's neighbor? as oneself. If, if we, we were saying, if you don't have enough love or the right love of self, then most probably mm. the love of neighbor will also suffer. Mm. But you know, the, the trouble is a lot of us are, are imperfect right from the start, right? Mm -hmm. So we love ourselves in an imperfect way because our parents are also imperfect, so they teach us the wrong way or love us the imperfect way. Yes. And so we keep carrying that down, right? Mm -hmm. And then so when you love other people, it's also imperfect. Mm -hmm. So how to, com how to correct that? Yeah. Or perfect that? Cannot, right? Unless He helps us. The grace of God. Yeah, unless yes. He helps us. <clears throat> the grace of God and keeping maybe Jesus as that model. Yeah. Yeah. If you have yeah. Jesus as your model for loving others, yeah. no, uh, of course you said it's difficult to self-sacrifice yeah. <laughs> because if you go to the second reading here, no? yeah. he offered himself. himself. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. That that is very difficult. Uh, I was I was talking to one one of our sisters who just lost a job, mm. and then I said, "What happened?" Mm. And I said, "I was." What I ha I quarreled with a fellow worker, mm. and I was uh, in the end. She what? She accused me of assault. Oh, wow. wow! So now I have a police record. Oh my goodness! Mm. And then I asked her, "Do you think it was worthy to fight?" Yeah. Said, no, it was nothing. But how? Oh, what can I do now? The regret, no? Oh. The regret. She could not find another job because of that record. Mm -hmm. She had to wait until the, the, the court will have a decision on that record. Oh my. You see? Must be aggressive, man. Yeah, in fact, it's, it's verbal. It was called verbal assault. Okay. You know? mm. It's not really violent, physical. Uh, not not fighting. Just the same. Not fighting. <laughs> but <laughs> just the same. You see the consequence the damage, of it. The damage, the damage yeah. done. To you, to the other, mm -hmm. said, yes, sister, it's really regrettable that it happened. And I could not find even the 
the woman now. <laughs> because the police was also saying, maybe you can just talk it over in make it okay. how do you call that extrajudicial yeah. extrajudicial settlement, yeah. no? Yeah. But nothing. She could not find the woman. <laughs> oh. uh, you mean the other lady has also is also out of the office, no more in the office. They were both they were uh, both fired. Five? Fired. Oh, oh, okay. So the, she can't even find her to settle out. Yes, oh yes, God. yes. Oh. So a, a simple thing like that, no? Mm. So uh, that, that's why maybe, I don't know, this, uh, I was talking of, about loving oneself. Yeah. Your measure for loving yourself is also the way you love the others. Maybe yeah. if, if, I'm just imagining yeah. with this situation, if you are provoked mm. and you are you have enough self awareness mm. self control mm. self control given mm. the holy spirit you don't go down into that level yeah. of having an assault mm -hmm. yeah okay and if you are yeah because you're aware no and then you can tell yourself i stop here yeah okay so the other is very angry i am also angry but then I can remove myself from the situation. Yeah. In fact, we were talking about that. Because I'm, I'm really sad for her. It's been, she was here for 11 years. Mm -hmm. uh, that means she has worked well, mm -hmm. you know. But then you meet some kind of provocation like yeah. this, and then you forget everything. Mm -hmm. That means the person must have drawn out the pain that, you know, that caused that reaction, yes, right? Yes, yes, and she yes. has not dealt with that past Mm -mm. brokenness right in her that's why it can bring out the words in yes, her right? it's a trigger yeah it's a trigger the trigger yeah. yeah i had a personal experience yeah. of that in late 2018 yeah. mm -hmm. my employer hired um because my companion yeah. went back for good right. mm -hmm. so i had a, a new companion mm -hmm. she worked for the former employer for yeah. 20 years right. mm -hmm. and the first week in our <coughs> house mm -hmm. she was it's so hard to deal with her because mm -hmm. she's older than me mm -hmm. and to cut the story short mm -hmm. um, my husband died in December mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. then when she know that my husband died she was I don't know instead of uh, sympathizing. Or, or sympathizing me she she was I don't know she was angry she was jealous she was saying that, how come this lady, um, um, why have so many people mm. loving her? Why mm. so many people mm. giving her uh -huh. you know, yeah, support? Yeah, the sympathy, the support. Yes. Okay. Then in January, <coughs> that morning, um, she was, because she was the cook, mm. I'm in charge with the children. So while she was cooking, the children write. Mm. But she already cleaned the table. Mm. But after, when the children write and they will erase something, yeah. The, yeah, 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 the table will be dirty there. again. Yeah. So, so when she's when she's about to serve the food, I said, just a minute, I need to clean this because yeah. then she was yelling, you're, you're too much, you're too stinky. Mm -hmm. um, I already cleaned that. Yeah. And I said, quiet. Because mm -hmm. I don't want the children to witness yeah. this yeah. kind. Mm -hmm. You know? Then after that, you know, when she passed mm -hmm. this side, mm -hmm. And she said, she do like that. Oh, mm -hmm. but and she told me, I'm you know, I'm not afraid <coughs> to be in prison oh, because okay. I don't have problem in my ch with my children anymore. Mm. Oh my but god! But you know, so you threatened you. Yes, mm. but you know, I calm down. I just because mm. I don't want to provoke here in front of the children. Yes, yes. You know, I was really quiet mm. until my boss went to office. Mm -hmm. uh, what's the time? Mm -hmm. I said 9.30, maybe my boss already settled down in the office. Mm -hmm. I messaged her, mm -hmm. Mom, uh, I don't feel safe and secure in your house anymore. Mm -hmm. Why? Um, please just check your CCTV. Oh. I don't want to... Oh. No, I don't want to <coughs> yes, no. yes, to yes. say Tell anything. her the details or anything. Oh. Yes. Just check your CCTV. Mm -hmm. Actually, mm -hmm. my... My family in the Philippines already contact the POAA and the Oboa because you threatened me. Yes, I'm not yes. afraid to kill you. 
Oh my God. She was telling me that there was something that just was really triggered. Yeah. You know, maybe that uh, she's mm-hmm. very crazy, maybe. <laughs> mm-hmm. And you know, um, I was I was telling myself, why should you do like that? If you are not, if you don't have problem with the, in the Philippines with your family, mm-hmm. I have many 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 people waiting just for waiting for me. For you know, yeah. not only my kids, mm-hmm. my relatives, mm-hmm. my friends. There are so many people. Mm-hmm. My life is only one, but people that is mm-hmm. waiting for me in the Philippines is mm-hmm. no hundreds. Mm-hmm. You know, so I love my life. Mm-hmm. You no, know? mm-hmm. so my employer said, don't do anything. Mm-hmm. Just be. You know. Yeah, just go to your room, yeah. Yeah. just be quiet. Mm-hmm. She did that 7 o'clock in the morning. Mm-hmm. 7 o'clock in the, at night, mm-hmm. my employer let her go. Oh, because okay. the employer checked the CCTV. Because oh, yeah. sometimes she will, ju- mm-hmm. she will wear just the underwear and then, you know, maybe she's oh. crazy. <laughs> but you know, oh, um, you know I really yeah. cannot... Uh, yeah. Loving... Mm-hmm. Loving... Yeah. Yourself, loving yeah, God yeah, yes, yes. as yourself, you know. Mm-hmm. I can apply to that because I was yes. telling, I know her story. Mm-hmm. She said she was uh, raped oh. Oh. when she was 18. So, so but I can't, be, I can't believe if you were raped, mm-hmm. how come you have three children with the same man? Oh. Well, we don't know. I mean, yeah, yes, that's I mean, why, we cannot believe it. That's but why that I can really, happen. That up, can up to now, mm-hmm. I really cannot. Um, uh, make myself angry with her. I always, I'm always praying mm-hmm. for her. Maybe she know? has, she has a lot because of because maybe she has problems. Yeah. That yeah. I don't understand. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Maybe she have, if she have problems that only God understands. Mm-hmm. So who am, who am I to judge, mm-hmm. to judge her? But no, when you are telling mm-hmm. about the story of mm-hmm. the, yes. it's really hard to work with another mm-hmm. helper. Mm-hmm. So but anyway, thank you for that sharing because I, I believe that is one good example of you being aware no, yeah. of yourself that you will not go down you know, into the same level of aggression. Yeah. Okay. Yes. And that's good. You, when you have situations like that, it's better to <coughs> first is keep quiet mm-hmm. and then go back to yourself. No? Yourself and then please. if you cannot really avoid the aggression, mm. get yourself out physically yes. from mm. that situation. Mm. Mm-hmm. No? Because as you wisely uh, know, there are the CCTVs around mm. that will show what really happened. Yeah. But the, the, I think the root of it all, the, the bottom line is that you know yourself. Yeah. Okay? Mm. And it's good also that, as you're saying, you cannot really judge what kind of woundedness the person has mm. that uh, it's under uh, I mean difficult to understand why the death of your husband could trigger yeah. your jealousy or you yeah. know could be so deep yeah. Mm, yeah. No? Yes, yes, yeah could be so deep anyway thank you for that because these are real stories yes yeah. mm. the, the difficulty <clears throat> of loving oneself I mean loving others as yourself mm. uh, is taken for granted Mm. When when I hear so many stories every week, I, I heard one yesterday who is already also without job, but still kept on sending money mm. to the family mm. because the mother had mm. a mild stroke, etc. But said, mm. where do you get your money when you have no work? Mm. No, and then she has sent how much already? But after three weeks. Everything she sent was gone, even if it was supposed to be a business, like uh, financing some kind of business to help mm-hmm. the family. Mm-hmm. So he said, uh, can you detach yourself for a while mm-hmm. and then look at the situation mm-hmm. no? uh, where you can also see your own dignity mm-hmm. and that you are not only seen by the others as a source of money. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Because sometimes it's yeah. like that, no? Yes. Your dignity <coughs> yeah. is only linked to how much you can give. Yeah. It's, uh, yeah, people are very much monetized now. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. yes. Monetized. Yes. Yes. Uh, we're, we're like, uh, okay. when they see us, they see money. 
Yeah. <laughs> she, she really yeah. said, yes, sister, that is true. Like, yeah. In fact, I am supporting not only my own family, but I'm supporting yeah. my mother, my father, my auntie, my cousin. Yeah. Yes. You know? mm -hmm. So I said, uh, try to uh, take some distance yeah. and then read the situation again in the right perspective. Is that still self, uh, right way of loving others? Mm -hmm. Is it not because you are already looking at yourself so low mm -hmm. that you have become just, you know, uh, identified to money? Mm -hmm. This is just one example. No, there are so many others. Yeah. There are so many others, and it's very sad. But I think that when you love your neighbor as yourself as well, you <coughs> must also try to differentiate between um, people who try to take advantage of you. You know, you you try to be a you try to be a very good friend to um people. Mm -hmm. uh, let's say I have I've seen a few uh, you know who actually um they they believe um they believe that their friends in Hong Kong mm -hmm. uh, uh they are also domestic helpers. Mm -hmm. They believe that their friends in Hong Kong are, are you know their bad but their buddies and uh, mm -hmm. people will talk back about them but they don't believe it and uh, when uh, they get into trouble they uh, become their sponsor for loans and things like that and then. With just yeah. one turn, mm -hmm. the uh, the friend is gone, yeah, yes. Mm -hmm. and uh, the uh, the person who has been the uh, doing the sponsor is now left with all the finances right. and uh, so on and so forth. Mm -hmm. And uh, some of them have come up to me and say, you know, what do I do now? So I say, well, we just have to work something out. But basically, do not give up just because there's one bad incident mm -hmm. does not mean that uh, you know you should uh, you should get this this. Um, whole philosophy mm -hmm. of uh, loving your neighbor as yourself. Mm -hmm. you, know, you should always uh, think good of people, but be also be aware, be, be careful because sometimes people do take advantage of yes, you. Yes, mm. yeah. yes, evil exists, you know. Yes. There is really this spirit mm. of evil reigning also. It's a battlefield. No? Mm -hmm. Our world is a battlefield. Mm -hmm. Okay. And that's why we need that grace, yeah, which mm. is, is right, saying we cannot just do it on our own. You know? mm. This love of God, uh, I was telling you that the answer of Jesus is not a simple commandment, it's a prayer. Mm -hmm. yeah? Quoted mm. from the from the first books of the of the Bible that here, O Israel. The Lord our mm -hmm. God is Lord alone. This is uh, make Him really the source of your strength and the source of your what actions, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and He will let you uh, have the light that you need. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yes. and He will mm -hmm. show you the way to do things. Yeah. But mm -hmm. if you don't have that clarity, if you don't have that relationship strong mm -hmm. enough, as Liliana is saying, yeah. you could really be put down. No, we heard that story of the Filipina who committed suicide because yes. the one who loaned, who made her the sponsor, was gone after got, he she got the money, yes. Yes. and she did not. You know, it happens to me how many times? Yeah. Yeah. Yes, then you forget. Yeah, and, and it's not small amount of money really, it's big yes. amount of money, they run away, they run away, mm -hmm. because maybe I'm easily um, convinced, mm -hmm. I easily, like, I pity someone, mm -hmm. if they cry to me, I, 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 mean, sympathize. I, I sympathize, mm -hmm. yeah. and then I have this conscience, if I will not help, <laughs> maybe God will angry to me, so there is this feeling that, okay, so I, 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 I get a trust, mm -hmm. so they took advantage, mm -hmm. and then if they get your feeling already, in a glimpse, they run. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. They do not show up anymore. And mm -hmm. it's not really small amount, it's mm -hmm. big amount. Mm -hmm. Yes. But your so, faith is bigger. Yes, but my faith is bigger. <laughs> exactly. Because I know God will feel those loss things mm -hmm. from me mm -hmm. and it's really true mm -hmm. he's always putting everything give it back mm -hmm. and give That's it right. back mm -hmm. so i say yeah. yes so our god is very merciful so yes. how, how come me i will not i will not forgive i will not because he's the one putting everything in mm -hmm. me he's giving a lot yes. and mm -hmm. even i don't deserve also so it's mm -hmm. okay i say no, it's okay. Uh, yeah. I guess the, the bottom line here we're saying is really determine and 
believe in your dignity yes. as, a, as a child of God, mm. you know, and, and do not just put your value as something material. Yeah. Yes. yes. Okay. Yes. Because uh, yeah. sadly, our world seems to thrive on that materialism, mm. consumerism, mm. And so everything is monetized. Sometimes, yes. you know, when mm. you have some gifts, there's Google, monetize your yes. <laughs> <laughs> So yes. you, you want to share some a good story, sell it, you know, <laughs> it's, it's really, it's like that. It's yeah. like that kind we of pay for your stories, <laughs> <laughs> monetize your experience. Monetize, monetize your experience. <laughs> yeah, true. I said, oh my God, is there any other way of living? Yeah. <laughs> you know, so let's go back to that always, no? Uh, the first, the first is you shall love the Lord your God with all your heart, with all your soul, with all your mind, with all your strength, and love your neighbor as yourself. And it, and it's very tight, mm -hmm. no? This commandment is very tight. These three loves, mm -hmm. it's very connected to each other. Yeah, sometimes, yeah, we we talk about our bad experiences, mm -hmm. but if we know that. This is not the whole of it. Mm -hmm. yeah. There is God always in the picture. It's not mm -hmm. the end of everything. Yeah. Yeah. God will always come there if you ask Him. Mm -hmm. He will give you the way out. Show True. you the way out. Mm -hmm. Okay? Agree. Agree. Yes. Agree. So, let us remember the unity of these three loves. Mm -hmm. And then mm -hmm. maybe bring it with us. Mm. Throughout all our life, not only this week, <laughs> okay? Yeah. And maybe with this also, this uh, strong, very strong connection, we will understand why we have this psalm. This psalm is so beautiful. Mm -hmm. Psalm 18. Mm -hmm. yes. We're towards the ending now. And you see, it's, I love you, Lord, my strength. Mm -hmm. Okay, because whatever happens, we know that He is there. We are connected to Him, True. and through this connection with Him, we are connected to each other. Mm. Yes, agree. okay. Yes. Mm. So, shall we end our sharing with this? Mm. Okay. okay, we'll pray together the song. Okay, I, I love, love you, Lord, my strength. I love you, O Lord, my strength. O Lord, my rock, my fortress, my deliverer, my God, my rock of refuge. My shield, the Lord of my salvation, my stronghold. Praise be the Lord, I exclaim, and I am safe from my enemies. The Lord lives, and blessed be my rock, extolled by God, my Savior. You who gave great victories to your King and showed kindness to your anointed. I love, I love you, Lord, Lord my strength. strength. Amen. 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 Thank you for tuning in to OLMC Sunday Best. Please join us again next week for another episode. Have a blessed Sunday, everyone.